Let's read the question carefully. Debt to equity ratio is 50%, tax rate 40%. We have cost of debt, cost of equity and we have been asked to calculate weighted average cost of capital. So the best way to deal with these questions on the exam is make a simple schedule like this. Let's have equity here and let us have debt. First we find out what is the cost of each of the component. So equity, the cost is given to us, we take that as it is. So cost of equity is 13%. The cost of debt is given to us as 8, however we know that there is a benefit of taxes on debt and therefore we should be taking the effective cost of debt which would be calculated as 8 into 1 minus 40%. So that's 8 into 60% which would be 4.8%. So this is the effective cost of equity, this is the effective cost of debt. Step number 2 is to calculate weights. Now the debt divided by equity ratio is given as 0.5 or 0.50% which means if debt is 0.5 equity should be 1 which means the total capital of the firm should be given as 1.5 so if total capital is 1.5 debt is 0.5 the weight of debt as a ratio to total capital should be 0.5 divided by 1.5 which is 33.33% and therefore weight of equity should be 66.66% so let's write down the weights here 66.66% for equity 33.33% for debt then we multiply A into B and add them up so 13 into 0.6666 which would give us 8.66 in the same fashion 4.8 into 0.3333 which would give us 1.59 and then we add up the two numbers which would give us a total of 10.26 the closest option is C and therefore C is the answer.